Hey, what's up, guys? Today we are going to talk about theft in Singapore. Theft is uh, governed under Section three seven eight of the Penal Code. Uh, theft is defined under Section three seven eight as whoever intending to take dishonestly any movable property out of the possession of any person without that person's consent moves that property in order to such taking is said to commit theft. So what are the elements of theft? Number one, dishonest intention. Dishonest intention is the intent okay, to cause wrongful gain or loss when the accused gains property to which he is not legally entitled. That means it doesn't belong to him. And a wrongful loss occurs when the victim loses property to which he is legally entitled. In other words, it belongs to him. Second element, moving movable property out of the possession of any person. In other words, the property has to be movable. What is movable property? I mean, it is not a property such as HDB, condo or landed property. It, you can't steal a house. You can't commit theft on a house. The temporary removal of an item where that item is subsequently returned to the rightful owner is sufficient to constitute theft. If the property was not in the owner's possession at the time it is, was moved, no theft would have occurred. This is because the property has not been moved out of the owner's possession. Third element, taking the property without the other party's express or implied consent. In other words, you take the property without that person's consent, without him agreeing to uh, lend it to you, whether express or implied. Under Section 379 of the Penal Code, Offenders may be liable for a fine or imprisonment up to three years for theft. For first-time offenders, a community-based sentence may be applied instead of a fine or imprisonment. Uh, this would apply where the offence committed is not too serious and the offender has not been sentenced to uh, imprisonment before. Examples of theft which may be considered less serious include theft of uh, low-value items, cheap items, while serious theft uh, may include repeat, repeat theft uh, offences, in other words, recalcitrant offenders. In addition to uh, fine or jail term, the court has the option uh, to order a mandatory treatment order. For example, if a person uh, is, su is, is suffering from a kleptomania, the, the psychiatric uh, illness where they just can't help uh, uh, stealing things, or day reporting order, community work order, community service order or a short detention order. A short detention order is uh, essentially uh, an order requiring uh, low risk, first time offenders to be sent to a prison up to 14 days. So thanks for watching this video on theft and its elements in Singapore.